Hi there, um, we've had some stock in today for um, Sweet Dixie and I'm going to do it a little bit different today because I'm all set up from a video I um, I did a few minutes ago. So um, as you'll see we've got all the boxes in the background which I apologise for but we're all ready for the show on the weekend. So I've been having a play with this and let's see if it works. Just um, put its pieces in the way. Okay, so sellouts are new. Sellouts, um, the wolf, um, that one always sells out um, every time you have it. Um, uh, Sweet Dixie round. And actually, I think, I think you might be able to see the size better on here. You'll have to let me know your thoughts, whether this is better or holding them up to my face like I do. Um, this one was very popular as well. Um, and so, no, I didn't actually have this one, did I? No, it was a snowman I had. Um, this was popular last year when I had it, and I've got um, quite a few of them. Um, and I think this one's around about three ninety nine. If that, and as you can see, it is a fair size on here. Should put it by um, an A five piece of paper, so you can see. Good idea. Um, some more of them, and then we have Merry Christmas. Okay, another sizable die to go in there. And as it happens, I kept some out earlier. I can find them. Like, oh, right in front of me. Just so that you can have a little look at how they match. A piece of white paper here. Now I have it. That's very good. Nicely embossed, I've done them in, else they will. So I've done them in red. And black. So as you will see, this is, as I said, a five, um, and it's a nice size. You could probably use it as um, <clears throat> uh, just the topper on its own with um, frame, etc. around it. Or it goes very nicely above or below. Um, you can use it with an, another topper is what I'm trying to say. <clears throat> so... Sorry for the um, throat, I've got a bit of a cold, or I did have. Now these um, snowmen I sold out of on the weekend. Put them right upside down. Let's bring back the A5. And I'm pretty sure he was only $3.99 too. Um, I'd have to check on them. So as I said, the snowmen just, <coughs> excuse me, they just went, as did the gingerbread house. Let me just get that. Yep. And that is a tidy size, as you can see. And as you know, Sweet Dixie, I mean, you see by these, these are quite intricate and they've, um, they've got mixed up together. Let's get the red one. So, I mean, you know, that just literally, they just fell out the bits in between. <clears throat> and then we've got Bethlehem. If you remember um, last week, I showed you Father Christmas and we've got um, Bethlehem along the same lines 
um, in that you've got the palm tree, you've got the um, star, and you've also obviously got Bethlehem. Now you don't see too many of these um, religious type dies. Um, well, I don't think you do anyway. And um, so they're excellent. Now the Father Christmas and the housing. Um, again, decent dies. However, I've got one I prepared earlier. Do it with your egg bag. And then you've got that gorgeous. Right, now you'll see what I've done. I haven't taken out all the holes because they do make nice windows in any case. You can see there. So you can either have them poked through or not. So that's them with them taken out. And you've got that one down there that's still left, or it can come out. There we go. Leave that one. There we go. Okay. Um, and the other back in stock is the castle plus the wedding car plus the kit. Okay, so that's it for today. We've got another show on the weekend where I'm expecting sellouts of these again because they did literally go very, very, very quickly um, on the weekend. If you do want to put any away, um, I suggest you um, tell me straight away and, and I'll hold them for you. I'm not sure how the stock is at the suppliers. Um, uh, otherwise you just have to take your chance really but as I say they, they did the Christmas ones in particular went um, so there you have it thank you for watching I shall come back quickly and see you soon bye